This is my dog Harry. He's never happier than when he's running through the woods, playing by the sea, exploring the rock pools and generally getting wet. He loves a bit of mud too. In fact, he's happiest when he's really filthy dirty. And then he knows he'll have to have a bath, which isn't his favourite thing. But he soon gets clean and dry. And then he's ready for his next adventure. I wonder how dirty he could get today. Today's story is called Mucky Pup by Ken Brown. Mucky Pup was having a wonderful time. He emptied the waste paper basket. He cleaned out the coal scuttle. He rearranged the tablecloth and shook the cushions. Oh, what fun! The farmer's wife didn't think it was such fun. Oh, you mucky pup, she cried. Out you go! But mucky pup wanted to play. He saw the cockerel. Will you play with me, he asked. Cockerel! Don't be stupid, crowed the cockerel. I'm a beautiful cockerel. You're just a mucky pup. Pup saw the duckling. Will you play with me, he asked. You must be quack, quack, quackers, quacked the duckling. I'm a fluffy duckling. You're just a mucky pup. Pup saw the cat. Will you play with me, he asked. How perfectly ridiculous, purred the cat. I'm a handsome cat. You're just a mucky pup. Pup saw the horse. Will you play with me, please, please? Nay, nay, neighed the horse. I'm a magnificent shire horse. You're just a mucky pup. Pup was sad. Who would play with him? Perhaps they were right after all. He was too mucky. He wandered outside into the yard. Suddenly, a snout appeared through the bars of the gate. Hello, said the piglet. Will you play with me? No, said the pup. I'm just a mucky pup. But I'm just a mucky pig, said the piglet. Let's play in the mucky mud. And that's just what they did. Until... Mucky Pup, called the farmer's wife. Bath time! But Mucky Pup didn't need a bath. He was a good, clean, clever pup and he settled down by the fire to dream about playing with his mucky piglet friend tomorrow. <laughs>